Fox, what was in the box? What's going on everybody? It's your boy Shogi from Shook Earth Media and today I'm very excited to show you guys what's inside this box. This is a Silent Hill 2 figurine of Pyramid Head from Silent Hill 2 and I'm very excited. I pre-ordered it last year. It's here and I'm excited to check it out. Let's just get into it guys. Let's get her open. Ooh, hopefully nothing's broken. <laughs> that would kind of suck. Also don't want to dox myself. Ooh. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There it is. All right, we don't need no stinking backs. We don't need no stinking backs. Let's see, moment of truth, dude. Moment of truth, dude. Okay. It's upside down. Okay. Don't want to use the scissors at this point. We're just going to rip this shit open, dude. We're going to rip it open, dude. Oh, look at this. I almost don't want to open this box. Oh, there he is. It's your boy. It's your boy. The red pyramid thing. That's actually what they call it. I love it. <laughs> Dude, this box art is fantastic. Look at this. And those are all just photos. It's very detailed. Let's take a look at it. Let's take a closer look at it. Ooh. Looks pretty cool. Now, the box art is so, like, beautiful. I'm almost ashamed to open it, but we gotta open it. <laughs> this has to be on my set. Or something. That's... That's the reasoning I gave for why I bought it in the first place. But let's be honest, I just wanted to buy it. I, I'm not a collectibles guy. I don't really have many collectibles. The things you see in the background of my set, I bought them just to put in the background of my set. <laughs> I don't really have many collectibles, so this is a rare thing for me. But, you know, Silent Hill, one of my favorite franchises ever. We need that sequel, man. Where's that next one? Every few months we hear about a new game, dude. I don't want to hear it anymore until it's ready, okay? Just show me it when it's done. <laughs> Everybody and their mother's working on a Silent Hill game, supposedly. Just do it already. All right, I'm going to get the letter opener. <laughs> I just said we don't have many collectibles, but check this out. Got the, it doesn't have the writing on it anymore because we've used it so much. But it's this Godric Gryffindor fucking sword, dude. It's the best letter opener ever. Yeah, okay, there we go. All right. Ooh, here it is. It's your boy. Check it out, guys. There he is. This just looks like a protective covering. Oh, it punches out on the back. Maybe it's like a stand? Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's like a little, it's perforated. Maybe it's like a little stand for you to use. Definitely a display thing. All right, guys, let's take it off. Take a look at what we got, though. We got this pole thing and it's, he's got a, his spike thing. I wonder if he has his uh, big blade as well. I imagine he does. <laughs> but we'll have to find out. Alright, let's see what we got. Do I have to undo any tape or anything? Oh, and don't ask me how much I spent on this. <laughs> the answer is too much. And also, I don't remember... And even if I did, I wouldn't want to. So, don't ask. <laughs> so, check it out. Ooh, these pieces falling out. <laughs> so, I don't know what this is. I'll get close-ups later. But I'm assuming that this, like, pops on here.
Oh, here it is. Here he is, guys. Whoa, dude. Oh wow. Great attention to detail. A lot of fine detail in there. I mean, you got the like red weird shit, the fleshy shit. Oh, dude, they even have the under, under his fucking. Oh my god, I'm gonna get close ups for sure, but this shit is gross. It's phenomenal. Okay, so no movement in the legs. His feet move. Oh, there is a bit of movement in the legs, actually. Okay. Yeah, so the feet do move. The legs move a bit. Hindered a bit by this, as you would imagine. But it makes sense. There is yet another layer. Okay, we got two things of tape to undo here. Oh yes, he does his blade, of course. Oh, and a bunch of different hands, look at this. Bunch of different hands, you got the stand. Oh, I'm glad he has a stand as well. Got a little plastic stand for him. Don't know what this is. Oh, okay, I guess it's a bag. So that you can put all the extra pieces in, I'm guessing. And here we got his big blade here. And I love some of the rust coloring on this and we got some nice texturing. So that's, that's great, love that. This. I'm guessing this is to hold him in place if you're if he's in the stand. Okay, we got instructions in Japanese. Oh, they're in English as well. Very nice, thank you. Appreciate it. Oh shit, okay, so this, look at this guys. You can take his, the helmet off and then you put this in and you can put him, you can put this in there like he's stabbed. Because, uh, you know, in the game when he dies, he's stabbed like that. So check this out. But various hands for him. Got the fist off. He's just a nice, friendly guy, you know? He's not so bad. I don't know, it feels like, I think this hole in the back is where this stand thing is supposed to go. And it really looks like it doesn't fit. Although, you know, now that I said so on camera, of course it's gonna prove me wrong. There it is. All right, so let's get the pose right. Let's check it out, guys. It's my own little pyramid head guy. Oh, he's such a nice, friendly guy, isn't he, guys? He's definitely not here to, uh, you know, execute me or anything like that. He's not here to, uh, you know, exact revenge on me or, uh, you know, punish me for my sins or anything. Definitely nothing like that, dude. Not anything like that, dude. So that's, uh, that's our figure, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's unboxing. It's my first unboxing ever. Trying to get him to stand on this thing, but I don't know. <laughs> if this is the best I can do, it works. It works. All right, guys. Well, we got our figure up on the stand here. He's posing. He's mid-swing. We swapped out the hands. He's got the blade. And I hope to see you guys in future videos. Hit the sub button if you like horror video games. We talk about that. We talk about Resident Evil. We want to see more Silent Hill games. So if that's ever announced, you already know your boy Shuggy making a video about it. So definitely say sub for that. And otherwise, we talk about movies, TV shows, doing a lot of Walking Dead content lately. But we do other stuff, too. Got Down Abbey video. It's a very different subject. But basically, it's just whatever I feel like talking about. So that's what we do. But, uh, yeah, he's we got this pose. You'll see him in the background of my videos. We'll do some different poses and stuff. Keep it interesting. 
I mean, we got a lot of options here. We got the, the spike thing. We got the, you know, whatever you call this. <laughs> got all these different hands. We got this thing so we can have them stabbed through the neck. So that might be cool. But yeah, guys, I hope to see you in future videos. Hit me up in the comment section if you got any questions or anything that other than what how much I paid for it because I already said that. <laughs> Alright guys, I hope to see you again soon and peace out. Everybody have a good one.